A gorgeous day here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, the scene for the ACC series between the Pitt Panthers and the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets. And another hit going right up the middle, a nice piece by Black as the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets are gonna score already. Dobbins sliding. She's gonna crack that one right over Whaley's head. It's gonna go to left field as two runners score now. And just like that, it's a 6-4 ball game. And she has done a stellar job still without a single strikeout. As this one's gonna be cracked to left center field and it's gone! Panthers tie it up here with a Brunson home run. What an absolute shot there by Brunson. Look at the excitement on her. Her arm guard falls off and just completely roped that ball and to get her team tied up here in the bottom of the seventh, an amazing at bat. You know, type of soft hitting. It's line drive shots off the wall and home runs. Strapola just Strapola going back and it is gone. Absolute moonshot to walk off this ball game. Wow, an amazing ending to this back and forth game. An exciting time for the Panthers, an absolute moonshot by Tripola to end this ball game. You want to keep it either low in the zone or somewhere where she's going to foul it off because she's probably looking to swing. Um, she's not behind too far in the count, but she's going to want to look to take a hold of one. She cracks that one to right field, as that one's gonna get right past the right fielder. She rounds second, going for third now, as Kauf's gonna get a triple. She looks to go home, and she's gonna be safe. An inside the park home run. As this one's cracked to left field, and that is gone! Kat Rodriguez with a two-run home run. Panthers are up on the first pitch. And the Panthers have split this game open. Kat Rodriguez. Without too much damage and really take advantage of that. As that one shot up to left field, Griggs got a bad angle on that. As everybody rounds, three runs score. And it's a tie ball game here. Pitt, Georgia Tech tied up in the top of the fifth after a double by Black. And just like that, at a moment's notice, things can change as this one's crushed to left center field. And that is gone! Sarah Beth Allen crushes it. And Georgia Tech now takes a two-run lead. Yeah, this Yellow Jackets team said, we're not out of this fight, and we are going to come back, and we are going to win this game and try and take this series over and take as many extra bases as possible. The pitch and that one's crushed to left field. That one's back and that one is gone. Dobbins with the two run home run. The Yellow Jackets now take a 10 to five lead over Pittsburgh. The pitch, the swing, Siemens all the way out and it's gone. A three run home run by Sarah Siemens. Cuts it down to one run deficit. The Panthers are back in the game in the bottom of the sixth. That one's cracked to left center field and that is gone. Dobbins with another home run in this game. The Yellow Jackets take the lead 11 to 10 at the top of the eighth. What a swing, Madison Dobbins. 2-2 two, two count, one out, no runners on base. That one's hit to left center field. That one's back, and that is gone. Edgman with a home run. The Yellow Jackets take the lead back at the top of the 10th. Ella Edgman going around the bases, meeting her team at home plate. A great hit out to left center field. That one's back and that one is gone. What a spark it was, Colin. What a great leadoff home run for the Yellow Jackets coming into the top of the sixth inning to put her team up one nothing. 
Crack to right field, back off the wall. She drives a run in, Allen goes for two, and she's got it. Wow. A double by Sarah Beth Allen to drive another run in for the Yellow Jackets. A hit to Black, and that's gonna wrap things up. A tough way to end it there for the Panthers. Olivia, your thoughts on the series? You know, I thought that this was a great series, a great showing on both sides of the ball for both teams. You know, tough, tough loss of a series by the Panthers, um, but Georgia Tech really solidified their spot um, and their chance to go into the playoffs, and Pitt just needs to fight their way through it. You know, they showed some good fight, and we know that they can do it. So I'm sure Hermanic is going to take that as a positive coming off this weekend.